smoking this barbecue. Um, just finished this cook on these ribs. Um, got some real good color um, on these spare ribs. You, these were the ones we used with the Heath Riles uh, competition rub. Love the color. Um, gonna cut these up. We sm Just to recap, just straight Heath Riles, um, nothing else. Um, wrapped them up um, with some cherry wood, um, smoked them. Um, Again, good color. Never used this rub before, but we're going to try these out. This is a live video cut. Nothing pre-cut, pre-nothing. Just a pure raw cut. I'm going to try these ribs out and see how they taste. Cutting like butter. These are just some Smithfields. Um, nothing special. So we're going to get a center rib to our uh, pit master, uh, Mike Kasmer. As you can see, these got phenomenal color, smoke ring, moisture, all that. I mean, th this is what, uh, I mean, if ribs look like this where you go, you're very fortunate. That, in my mind, is a perfect rib. That's a center cut bone, which is the best bone you can have. And the fact that you got that type of smoke ring and that type of moisture is incredible. Pitmaster Mike. All right. It's not every day you get to uh, just picking it up. It's wow. Get a money bite of that. Wow. Doesn't tug, doesn't pull. Clean to the bone. Phenomenal smoke flavor. A little bit of stickiness. Excellent rib. Again, when you're thinking about barbecue, you're looking at your, your events, graduation parties, birthday parties, whatever, give us a shout. We ain't playing. Smoke goodness. It's not Peace. falling off the bone.